What's up, Reject Nation? I'm Greg Alba. I'm John Humphrey. D23 Expo in Anaheim is going on right now. We're waiting for stuff to drop, waiting for that Mandalorian trailer uh, to come out at some point, and then whatever else. I heard there might be a Lady in the Tramp trailer expected to debut. You'll best bet that we'll be covering it. As of today, I think as of today, I figured in the meantime, uh, let's talk about something. Disney Plus. Oh, good. Apparently, they've unveiled some posters for their Disney Plus shows, and I thought it'd be fun to take a look at them. Let's do a poster reaction. S sometimes people are like, poster comes out, I'm like, I don't want to do a video about just one poster, but apparently there's several. Oh, good. Let's so do 10 let's, let's go into it, all right? Which one first, John? Let's uh, do... Mandalorian or Lady and the Tramp? Those are the two big ones. Uh, let's start with the Mandalorian, because I feel like there's less going to be a surprise there. Yes. All right. Wow. That's Logan and Terminator Dark Fate look <laughs> great. <laughs> yep, yep. I like this template. It's a well-worn template, and, uh, you know, it fits into the vibe that they're going for with the Mandalorian. Yes. Western spaghetti sort of thing. I like it. No, you, you, I think you get a lot of the really cool vibes from it. Uh, like you said, Western spaghetti flair that they're talking about, the, the lone warrior vibe. You can see a ship in the background called uh, Razor Quest. I don't know where IG-88 is. Why aren't we focusing more on IG-88? Where's Taika? Where's Taika's character? Yeah, man. But I think that looks really cool, man. It is a cool poster, yeah. yeah. I mean, it, it definitely makes me think of that theme from Star Wars. That... Yeah. That, like, sad theme that they play sometimes in the deserty scenes. I like know? the text that they have a lot for it, too, of where it says the Mandalorian. Yeah. I like how, yeah, I like how you got two, two versions of the, of the Mandalorian. Shop <laughs> yeah. it's let's put literally... it right there with the sunset in the background, and then, real, and then let's put it right there in the A as well. I love that, because you can see the Photoshopping. You're like, okay, so you took the horizon and transposed it and probably stretched it a little onto this word, and then you took your little man here, your little Mandalorian, Mandalorian man. And it's the same exact photo. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, so no, the, see whole the, the, whole, the whole photo is <laughs> the same thing, but just in the Mandalorian. Yeah, just <laughs> slightly remixed yeah. spatially, but yeah, you can see all the same antennas and stuff. Except, uh, uh, to me, it looks like his head is slightly turned to the right. Oh, Plenty of Star Wars fan theories to come out of dude, there. Dude, what is he looking at? It could be anything. Yeah, but no, I am excited for this show. Yeah. I'm, I'm eagerly anticipating the trailer for that. Alright, let's look at the next big one. Lady and the Tramp. Ooh. Not bad. It's not Ooh. a bad po I've been actually really wondering what about this whole thing. I don't <laughs> I heard that the dog who plays the tramp is uh He's a, a real dick dog. on set. <laughs> yeah, oh man, he was a total diva. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And no, it's uh, it's a rescue dog, apparently. Oh. Tell you what, man, let's pull you out of here. Let's give you a job. Let's get you to work. <laughs> You're like, man. hey, homeless man, come star in our Disney film. <laughs> I'm really wondering how this one's going to go down because they got real dogs. They obviously CGI'd some of them <laughs> for their eyes and the expressions and stuff. They look sad. You it's know, that Lion King syndrome. Yeah. Uh, you can't really make their faces move too much. But dog, but dogs emote. Dog, dogs you can do tell when dogs are smiling and stuff. Dogs do emote, and I think they've given them both, you know, at least the mouth curvature of a smile. But there's something about those like big dog eyes. I think mm. that communicates a certain sense of longing, sadness, or some kind of like. Do you still love me? Yeah. yeah. They're, they're both giving each other the Ryan Gosling stare right now. Yeah, yeah. they're both giving each other the thousand miles. They're staring it looks, directly it past each other. looks like they're doing one of their acting class exercises when they got these dogs ready <laughs> to, <laughs> to learn to make eye contact, feel each other out. Yeah. No. Very very curious to see footage. I wonder if they'll have like these Rover. dogs walk the red carpet. Oh, they'll be in the, the theater. I wonder if they're at D23 right they're, now. Yeah, this they're very on the moment. Yeah. yeah. People are throwing <laughs> treats up at the stage. I baked these for you myself. I'm a huge fan. Okay, then what else do we got here? We got oh. this thing called Noel. What is this? Saving Christmas together? Oh, joy. I don't know. It looks like they're going to have to take on the role of Santa Claus in some way or another. I have, oh. I've never even heard of this. I know, but it's got Anna Kendrick and Bill Hader, so it's got to be... You know, appealing. Out of everything they've announced, for, I have no footage to go off of but this poster. 
this looks the most like made for TV. Yeah, thing this, this literally done. looks yeah. like a Hallmark this looks Christmas like an movie. ABC Family <laughs> like special Christmas movie they've done, which I'm sure will be a big hit. I'm I'm a sucker for those kinds of little Christmas movies that are so cheesy and corny. But come on, it, yeah. they're both very talented though. And Bill Hader, even uh, uh, totally unrelated, kind of it. Chapter two, mm -hmm. the big scene stealer that everyone's raving about is oh, Bill yeah, Hader. Anna Kendrick, Anna Kendrick. Yeah, 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 she shows up, makes a cameo, and steals the whole show. Yeah, I feel like it'll be one of those Hallmark movies but instead of what? you know like Hasselhoff or Andy McDowell we'll get you know superstars like yeah. Bill Hader and Anna Kendrick. Whoa I'm, we're on Disney Plus's Twitter right now. Mm -hmm. See the world through his eyes the world according to Jeff Goldblum? This is news to me and I'm so oh, this is a great idea. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Do I go with tattoos, bicycles, barbecue, gaming, jewelry, cosmetics? Medics, sneakers, call ice cream. Look out, Jerry Seinfeld. <laughs> what the hell is this show? I don't know, but <laughs> I'm just in... Jeff Goldblum's stream of consciousness. I I that kind of entertaining. Hope so. Yeah, <laughs> I want to see the world according to Jeff. For Goldblum. streaming service based, this, this seems like the most internet based show you can do right here. Yeah, this seems like a perfect streamer. <laughs> my, one of my favorite. I listen to Conan O'Brien needs a friend, the podcast, and one of the oh, best ones is the Gold one with. Is yeah, great, uh, that's yeah. A, that's a beautiful one right there. Oh, I've seen all of these movies. <laughs> Oh, this is by far the most exciting. Yeah, we, we got a... High School Musical, High school. The Musical, The Series. What? Oh. What a terrible title. Oh, this, this poster's hurting my teeth a little bit. They're <laughs> almost all in this together. That's fine. The tagline's fine, and that girl in the middle looks like... Uh, like a aged down version of an actress I saw in a Disney movie like ten years ago, so that's freaking me out. But uh, yeah, this is a a weird post. <laughs> yeah, well, it looks like they're trying to cover all <laughs> kinds of markets here. You got the. Oh, yeah. It looks like they're trying to transition everything that has been Disney produced on television yeah. to uh, <laughs> this Disney Plus show. You got your ABC Family Christmas movie. You, you got, got your Disney Channel movie. Original, <laughs> or yeah. show. It's show a, oh, yeah. that, that's a difference, too. It's a series as opposed to a movie because it was high school movie. Musicals were movies. Look out, Glee. High school. That's just a terrible title. High school musical, the musical, the series. Why not just call it High School Musical, the series? That's... Yeah, the the no, that's gonna be a hashtag train that's, wreck. Waiting to that's, so, that's so dumb. Why, why, do you, why would you bother calling it the musical? We get it. We got it. We've gotten it for years. Oh, Troy Tra Bolton. We understand. The least we know about is High School Musical, and yet I have the most to say about this one. Is, yeah, that is well, just awful. Yeah, I really want to know what they were thinking with that. Are they, are they playing the kids of Zac Efron and Vanessa Hudgens? Do they think that by going High School Musical this series, people will go? Well, is there no music yeah. now? <laughs> like, is it not a musical anymore? Instead of Corbin Blue, they got this girl. Mm hmm. Awesome. Yeah, it's going to be great. It's going to be, yeah, they're all the descendants of the original high schoolers. <laughs> yes. And then, you know, occasionally they'll come back for like a PTA episode. This is the weirdest variety announcement I've seen of no. any. You got your badass <laughs> thing. You got your badass thing. You, you got, got your remake of oh, yeah, Sentimental yeah. Classic. <laughs> then you got your weird stream of conscious thing, I think, to appeal to. Like, that's not going to appeal to kids or families, the world, according to Jeff Goldblum. I think it just yeah. appeals to all of us in the middle who are just like, Jeff. Jeff Goldblum, anything. Jeff Goldblum, yeah. yes. <laughs> okay, then you got your romantic comedy with adults, and but weirdly, the Noel one might be able to entice uh, more than enough people with the idea that you have two actors who are really drawn to adult audiences, especially yeah. Bill Hader. Yeah. And, uh, you know, Anna Kendrick. And it's a safe bet. They always, so I have a friend who's always given me that advice. Is if you're in the movie biz, always do something Christmas. Because uh, that's the gift that keeps on giving. This is great. This is the most exciting thing to currently come out of D23 at this moment. I heard uh, Ming-Na Wen is going to be, she's being honored. And she's going to be in the Mandalorian show. All right, yeah. Uh, I don't know if it's like a, a series regular or just like an episode Same or something like that. Same characters, Ava's a shield. <laughs> oh, yeah. Coming on over. Avengers Campus, you were seeing some footage from that so mm -hmm. there is more news expected to come out but while we're filming let's just make sure that there's nothing else that has currently dropped in the meantime oh it looks like sony studios is burning to the ground oh interesting yeah. now there's people cosplaying right now <laughs> really? uh, being like uh, someone's dressed up as spider-man i saw a photo going oh, around no. of saying i belong with marvel not sony no they have to address it tomorrow because like marvel uh, like the they, movies and stuff are they, being talked about on saturday so they have to address it 
it. They have to, or else somebody's gonna get on the mic and be like, "Um, so what? 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 What happened with all this Spider-Man business?" <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, they they usually moderate the questions. They, they ask yeah. them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't ask about that. I did see uh, 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 Robert Downey Jr. and Tom Holland posing together, mm-hmm. and um, I heard Tom Holland unfollowed uh, Sony, but then. <laughs> Amy Pascal is tweeting him nonsense. I can't talk about this. Unfollow them. (laughs) What can I do to that it doesn't break my contract but show that I'm upset? (laughs) And then in the future, contracts will be like, you can't unfollow us for five years. Yeah. 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 All right, guys. Well, keep a lookout for when we'll cover like actual footage that they release online. If it's anything leaked, not going to cover it because I don't want to get in trouble. Uh, Let those other people who are uploading get in trouble. (laughs) Well, to keep up with us you can subscribe to the real rejects click that notification bell so you can get notified when we have a new video up uh we'll catch you guys soon